Hi everyone, my name is Khadi Madipa and we will be doing an interview with Jay Kim. I hope you guys are super excited. This is one of our favorite interviews that we'll be doing with K-Africa Mag. So let's jump right into it. How would you introduce yourself? Who is Jay Kim? Oh, who is Jay Kim? <laughs> yes. Yeah, actually, uh, usually uh, I don't explain. Um, I don't want to explain about Jay Kim. Mm -hmm. Because my name is, my name is Young Jae King, mm -hmm. so different. I think it's different person. Mm -hmm. But as a choreographer, mm -hmm. um, Jae King, he <laughs> he just want to express and or share mm -hmm. his story or some messaging message, mm -hmm. message and then uh, his emotions mm -hmm. uh, and uh, he like um, uh, like conversation with people mm -hmm. like. Mm -hmm. yes. What inspired you to become a choreographer and a dance instructor? Actually, uh, when I think about myself, mm -hmm. um, I'm not a good dancer. Oh, what? <laughs> because think about myself. Okay. Yeah, because um, uh, I started dancing when I was 14 years old. Oh, wow. But at that time, I was people with great dancers. Oh, amazing. Yeah, but uh, after then, um, but I always um, want, want, I like more creative things. Mm. But usually, uh, break dance is really good dancing style, mm -hmm. dance style. But I always focus on my emotions, mm. you know. But mm. it's, uh, sometimes um, I can explain my feeling through mm. a break dance. Mm. But I don't know. But you just, uh, at the time I was b boy, mm. uh, I always. Uh, with my best friend mm. for 10 years, mm -hmm. 10 years, but after then we had to go to an service, mm -hmm. service, right? Two years. After then I already want to keep my dancing life, but my friend found their one job, you know, so left alone. <laughs> <laughs> but at the time, I just want to keep dancing life. Yeah. So uh, there is no help region mm. be a dancer and mm -hmm. choreographer because I want to show uh, to my friend, yeah. I I can I um, now I keep my dancing life, so mm. I want to show that mm. yeah, that's the reason. Yeah. But yeah. after that, I um, region uh, I I found my one region uh, in Mexico City, uh, and yeah, because that's why is pe I realize people some someone uh, need me, mm -hmm. so I have to do. Mm -hmm. So this region, so I become career for now. Oh, so you like instructor? Well, that's wonderful. <laughs> How do you think choreography mm -hmm. in K-pop has evolved from when you first started mm -hmm. as a choreographer to now what you're seeing with K-pop? Actually, uh, when I start dancing, mm -hmm. I mean, when I uh, start dancing in one minute and one minute just oh, yeah. uh, at the time, um, choreography scene is not popular in Korea mm -hmm. and even throughout uh, K-pop um, scene is getting famous mm -hmm. but many people didn't know this situation because mm -hmm. um, K-pop scene is getting famous in, in the world mm -hmm. but um, K-Korean people is not interested mm -hmm. Korean is not interested in this, uh, this scene, <laughs> K-pop scene yeah. but uh, many things has changed yeah. many K-pop artists mm -hmm. uh, I'll say want to uh, try to make this more creative one mm -hmm. because there are have so many K-pop artists mm -hmm. in K-pop scene mm -hmm. but usually it just looks like same same performance mm -hmm. so usually some guys try to do these uh, new things yes yeah that's why I already uh, well, saw it's many different culture right yes yes and other uh, dance like salsa or African yeah. or something um, how to say it's so like Piano, piano. Classical. No, it's in here. Famous things. Piano. I'm a piano. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, right, so, so, okay. <laughs> yeah. K-pop entertainment is usually is, uh, uh, don't want to get risky, mm -hmm. you know. But nowadays, so they have to do some more. 
combine and sort of mix mm -hmm. some, uh, yes. some other things. Yes. Yeah. K-pop is considered to be a fusion of several genres, and like you were already alluded to, the idea that you know there's a mix of different um, inspiration that you that we're finding mm, yeah, yeah, in yeah. dance, especially. So would you say say the same has been reflected in the dancing? Do you see them moving like within a K-pop music video, for instance? They are going from what they usually would have um, done in Korea to um, other types of dancing, like mm -hmm. hip hop or, mm -hmm. or um, modern or something like yeah. that. Yeah. K-pop dance is like um, from hip hop dance mm. because that's why it's uh, usually uh, I like more um, contemporary modern oh, contemporary yes, style. Yes. Than hip hop, but I like it. <laughs> hip hop dance can make it more good synchronized. Mm -hmm. so contemporary is uh, have to follow is their one mm -hmm. feeling, mm -hmm. one style. Mm -hmm. So it's sometimes too hard yeah. for you synchronize. And the music was also like sounds like yeah. a bit of hip hop, so yeah. it's easier to create yeah, dance for yeah. that. Okay, all right, all right. <laughs> so how do you come up with choreography? Do you collaborate with other people or do you listen to the song and then you walk away and you decide on yourself and this is how the dance should be? How do you come up with the idea for, for a piece of music? <laughs> uh, usually um, I always focus on my uh, my own people. Uh, okay. yeah. In the first I just uh, focus on myself mm -hmm. but now has been Mm -hmm. So usually I told my students um, go out mm -hmm. and you guys have to get new experience because mm -hmm. choreographer and dancer so we mm -hmm. dancer so we always have to uh, and try to do express this, uh, some subject so yes. like sexy and happiness or everything yes. but usually they don't have this experience yes. they don't have experience so usually so, um, they to just sing it, you know. Yes. They don't know this feeling. Yeah. yeah but I'm sexy one, so like, but it's like no one. Yes. You know? For me, I just uh, always watching um, musical and uh, show, yeah. uh, contemporary show mm -hmm. and movie. Mm -hmm. uh, but usually, I always um, focus on mo the movement feeling. Okay. Yeah. So it's a great friend, or so I try to spend time with uh, my own. What are some of the similarities and the differences you've realized amongst people as you teach choreography across the world? Like, what are the things that people do the same regardless of where we are? And what are some of the differences that you see? I didn't know there's many country, uh, how say, culture? Mm -hmm. Cultures, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, another culture. Mm -hmm. And they um, just compare to Korea mm -hmm. in the Western culture. Mm -hmm. So very different. Mm -hmm. So because usually Korean uh, dancers are more focus on it's like synchronized mm -hmm. and then more movement, clean movement. Yes, yeah. I've seen that in music videos. Correct. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. So the we can make the kaibo move. You know, the kaibo move is like synchronized good. Okay. So we call it kaibo move. Okay, kaibo move. <laughs> yeah. Okay, and we'll see that hopefully. Yeah, but. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the rest of dancers and choreographers, they yeah. more focus on their one style and feeling. Mm. So usually it's, um, usually it's diff difficult for synchronize. Yes. Yeah, but um, yeah, I think it's most uh, different things. Mm -hmm. it's, mm. it's and when you teach new people, are they all of them all mm. very nervous? Or are they some of them excited? Or how are they? But usually it's uh, when I met first, uh, when, when they met Meet you, yeah. Yeah, yeah meet uh, when each other. Mm -hmm. It's usually it's, I can feel, oh, this guy is very <laughs> shy or yes. nervous. Yes. Yeah, I can feel their feeling. Mm -hmm. But usually after then they realize, oh, it's, this is it. Mm -hmm. So, so oh, why Jay mm -hmm. say, say to me it's like this? Mm -hmm. So, you, so usually it's my style. Uh, usually I can explain about my style. Yeah. style. But usually I uh, try to show mm -hmm. myself, then they can, after that they understand my style. Mm -hmm. What do you love most about being a dance instructor? Mm. Uh, <laughs> you love everything. Yeah, yeah, I love <laughs> my job because my job. That's good. But uh, I think it's the mm, best one. Mm -hmm. um, but usually, usually, sometimes I can have some dancing mm -hmm. left. Or some their life, but 
usually it's a someone um how to say it's a head has the um, heart like so but it's usually they say to me so like Jay thank you because you have to keep dancing and you always uh, your dance is really good so inspired me uh, your dance many how to say giving me something so, so yeah. I want to keep my my life with something stuff. Yeah. So I like this situation. Yeah, and we can all say that like dance is a form of art, and art helps us to escape whatever we're going through yeah. in life. Yeah. So when you are teaching somebody <laughs> of art, like yes. they feel very excited. I try my and, best. Yes, exactly. So then they don't think about what it is that they're going through at that time. So it's certainly a gift. Yeah. Um. So what are the most exciting? What are you most excited about when it comes to the workshop that you? We do it here in South Africa. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> honestly? Yes. <laughs> Very honestly, okay. Mm -hmm. This is my first first time here. Mm -hmm. So actually I can expect um, to um, how say teach in here. Mm -hmm. Teach K Hub here. Mm -hmm. Because that's why uh, usually I I live in Korea mm -hmm. so I couldn't expect is uh, how many people like K pop K-pop or yes. K-drama yes, or something. Yes, it's very popular. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So at first, I I couldn't imagine this situation. Yeah. But I, I, how they came here. Mm -hmm. So I watching them. It's like they are have many passion. Mm. They have good skill. Mm -hmm. Some people. Very passionate. Oh, mm. some people. Okay. Yeah. 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 Honestly. Okay. <laughs> but yeah. usually, um, it's different because usually Korean people is like, like usually it's shy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But here is usually they always want to try mm -hmm. to do something and they ask too much. But I like mm -hmm. because it's good. Mm -hmm. And then the then the South Africa dancer 친구들이 아무래도 조금 힘도 좋고 어쨌든 스케줄이 있고 하지만 아무래도 이제 그러니까 그냥 커버만 해서 그냥 진짜 따라하는 정도의 사람들이 되게 댄서들이 많아요. 친구들이 어떻게 이거를 배우고 그다음에 어떻게 연습을 하고 이런 과정들을 배우게 되는 그 과정을 이렇게 좀 했습니다. 아, 네. So like this like the fact that South Africans have like power and skills, but mostly uh, they've been just following the covers in the in, in the music videos. Yes. They don't like actually follow like what the intention of the music or and so on. Yes. So like you know Jay uh, being an instructor like in teaching. You know, those students, what the actual intention or like everything uh, behind the music, yes. kind of like you're um, making like you're happy and proud of what he is doing. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, now, um, what would you say has been your biggest cultural shock since arriving in South Africa? What has been shocking to <laughs> you? Other than the weather, okay? Almost. <laughs> um, oh, it's how to say. Explains ton of electronic. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> two or three, two hours, right? Something. There's no cheating. Okay. Why should I do? Yeah. <laughs> should I go to sleep? Oh, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, that's, yes, okay, yeah. I totally understand. Yes, yeah. no cheating for sure. Okay. So, with the workshop that you'll be conducting, what do you look forward to the most? Um, they. Uh, I want to. I wanna. It's a day. It's a fine. Their one style. Mm -hmm. It's not saying, not to saying to uh, some uh, some others. And then usually, so they ask me, so like, how can we become good, better dancers? So yeah. They didn't know is so why they their how the skill mm -hmm. can anymore uh, get better. Yeah, get better mm -hmm. like this. So I keep. I already taught is many different styles. Mm -hmm. from me. Mm -hmm. So and they can feel oh this is a uh, good up uh, good match mm -hmm. good match with me mm -hmm. or not mm -hmm. is a so after then they can choice their one style. Which and, style they like. Yeah, yes, yeah. depending on what really works of yes. course with them. Okay. You. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want your students to take away from your classes? Mm -hmm. Love the sense. Mm -hmm. To love to dance? No, love them. To love them. Oh, wow, wow. That's good. <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> okay, so now that we're, we're ending on that note, uh -huh. could you kindly teach us how to dance, what we can look forward to in the workshop? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> okay. let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>